So the Pirates of Pike County were unstoppable in this week's High Five Sports Team Poll of the Week and taking top honors with more than 5,000 votes. It's the third Team of the Week honor for the Pirates, but there's no doubt that this one is very special. Yes, Good day, Paul Milliken is live in Zebulon this morning. Paul, the Pirates wanted this pep rally. I was down there for the original one down there, and I remember how they like to party in Pike County. Well, wow, you're that old, huh? Bob? That was like 50 years ago you were down here for that pep rally. Yeah, I was here last year, and this was easily one of our favorites. And I've got really exciting news for you, Buck, and you, Portia, because I know you wanted to see it. So remember yesterday, I tried to learn some dance oh, moves. No. I didn't feel like I Paul, quite mastered we them. Sorry, you're breaking up. I can't We've hear got you. the dance team right oh. in the front row. So Technical dance team, wait, stand up, stand up, stand up. Yes. Yes, you're doing it. Okay, now you just showed me how to do my new favorite dance. Oh, no. Show me how to do it again. All right, let's see it. Let's see it. Oh, yes. No. Now, see, I mean, ball. when she does it, it doesn't look that hard. Okay, on the count of three, we're doing it together. All right? One, two, three. <laughs> yeah, you make it look really I mean, hard. that wasn't that bad, right? How y'all doing, Pirates? How you doing? There's the football team, Pirates! How you doing? Oh, we love being at this school. Now, of course, we're here to celebrate the football team, but before we get to the football team, we got another very special team right here. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the volleyball team with some amazing accomplishments. So, wait a minute, tell me again. You guys have some pretty amazing accomplishments. Tell me what they are. Uh, we've gone to state for, for the past four years, and this year we're area champs. Wonderful, area champs! And here's what's really amazing. They've gone to state four out of five years. You're only a five-year-old program. Amazing. Give it up for the volleyball team again. And I'll tell you, I mean, if you really are area champs, you should be able to do this. They'll see, do it, try it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on, right here, you can do it. No, wow, so disappointing, not one. All right, I'll do it for you. I mean, if they're not gonna do it, then I'm gonna do it. All right, well, before we go on any further, we need a little music here at Pike County. So if we can get the band started, let's get some music going. Looks like the football team's got some moves over here. Okay. Okay, number three, I see you. I don't know. I don't know if number three's moves are as good as mine, but I appreciate the effort. Hey, in case you guys didn't know, there's another really, really important reason that we're here this morning, and that has to do with that hashtag you may have seen, hashtag Dylan Strong. We're going to explain what that means and why this season has been so memorable and emotional for this team coming up in the next hour. Plus, the hand trophy presentation. Stay tuned. All right. Thanks a lot. No doubt they have a lot of reasons to uh, try to win this season down in Pike County. Yes, indeed. And coming up tomorrow morning, 